The Outback blurs the line between wagon and SUV, but it's more affordable than similarly sized SUVs and just as capable and practical. Minor updates for the 2018 Subaru Outback make an already good thing better. Subtle styling tweaks, like more angular headlights and a slightly larger grille, maintain the Outback's clean, unfussy design, while an updated multimedia system and retuned transmission improve usability and drivability. Compare the 2017 and 2018 models here. The Outback's most direct competitor, spiritually if not in size, is the VW Golf Outrack, another tall wagon with a WD. The Outback also competes against more traditional mid-size SUVs like the Ford Edge and Jeep Cherokee. Compare them here. Boring? Not so fast. While the Outback's exterior styling doesn't raise eyebrows, it stands out among the throngs of SUVs in grocery store parking lots and school drop-off lanes in that it's not an SUV, or at least, not exactly. Its tall wagon looks set it apart from the pack, though with each redesign it takes on more of the bloated stance of an SUV. The Outback's cabin has always had a utilitarian, serviceable look to it, but there's a surprise inside for 2018. Interior design is classier across the lineup, and materials quality is better overall. Subaru even added a dose of luxury in higher trim levels, with high-quality materials highlighted by padded plastic where it counts, plus comfy leather seats with contrast stitching and faux, but believable, low-gloss wood paneling on the door sills and dash. New stitching on the upper dash of top trim levels also adds some pizzazz. These small pops of unexpected luxury impress in the thoughtfully designed cabin. The controls got tweaked, too. A standard 6.5-inch touchscreen replaces last year's smaller unit, and an 8-inch touchscreen is optional. The graphics are crisp and modern, the menus straightforward and easy to use. Even better are the handy tuning and volume knobs. Apple CarPlay and Android Auto smartphone compatibility are new this year, and they're standard. Lastly, the climate controls have been relocated directly under the multimedia screen for a more cohesive look.